That statement alleges that the eyewitness may have misidentified Mac as the shooter. A frightening discovery for a West Palm man as he notices a car upside down in the Intracoastal. The man found the car underwater at about 11 last night. It was located at the intersection of South Flagler Drive and Bunker Ranch Road. Police freed the driver from the car and rushed him into an ambulance. A man walking his dog says he discovered the accident. We heard what sounded like at first we thought was uh, maybe a burglar alarm across in Palm Beach going off, but as we walked by it sounded closer and closer and I walked, looked, walked over and looked over there and saw the car turned upside down, you know, the lights on and everything and the horn going. So we ran across the street here at this house and had the guy call 911. Police searched for other victims but say they found no other passengers. Bad news for some St. Mary's Hospital employees this morning after word of major cutbacks. Old alarm with battery on his wife. Port St. Lucie police were called into his home Monday after he allegedly hit his wife and refused to let his 12 year old son leave the house. Police did not arrest alarm at the time because he was not considered a threat to anyone. Alarm is now out on bond. More than a dozen rescue units rushed to help a man when he lost control of his car and flipped into the Intracoastal late last night. Now, it happened in the 5500 block of South Flagler Drive, and that's where paramedics worked feverishly to revive the 31-year-old man. He was rushed to Palm Beach Regional Hospital. A man walking his dog nearby tried to help. We walked by, it sounded closer and closer, and I walked, we walked over and looked over there and saw the car. Turned upside down, you know, the lights on and everything, and the horn going. So we ran across the street here to this house and had the guy call 911. Now, police say the driver was speeding east on Bunker Ranch Road and just kept going right into the Intracoastal. A truck collides with a car, sending a family of four to the hospital. It happened at the intersection of Jog Road and Southern Boulevard this afternoon.